Welcome to the Titan Pantheon. The Titan Pantheon is a new building within your kingdom. It does not have to be built and is accessible from the start. The Titan Pantheon contains all Titans and collections. All Titans, unlocked from Castle Level 1, houses every Titan in the Dawn of Titans universe. Tapping on a Titan will reveal more information about it, specifically which area of Dawn of Titans they can be acquired from. Engage in events and battling to help you collect as many Titans as possible. Collections are unlocked inside the Pantheon at Castle Level 6. For collections, you must acquire specific Titans. Collecting those Titans will reward you with prizes like Titans and unique relics. Each collection has tiers. After completing Tier 1 of a collection, if you level the same Titans to the next required level, you will earn even more powerful rewards. Each collection can have multiple tiers and new collections will be added over time. Thanks for watching and we'll see you on the battlefield. Alright, welcome DOT Gamers to another episode episode of Dawn of the Titans Theatres of war. <clears throat> These of war show your strength. So it's a two day event. Introducing the Altars of War to Theaters of War. Redeem acquire relics of war to unlock incredible rewards at the temple. Redeem relics of war at the Altars of Skirmish and Altars of War for a chance to win a variety of combat relics and titans. Altars of War. Redeem 40 Relics of War to unlock 4 star Titan Pigsy for the temple. Redeem 30 Relics of War to unlock 4 star Titan Volaron from the temple which are all physical. Redeem 15 Relics of War to unlock 3 star Titan Baron from the temple. Relics of War have a chance to drop from all tiers of Theories of War. Defeat the gold tier Theories for the greatest chance. All Relics of War tokens can be saved for future events. Show your strength in the Theories of War. Take on powerful Titans in Theories of War. Battle Pigsy, Volron, and Baron now. Three star, the well, sorry, three tier bronze, silver, and gold. Each tier will have different timers and unique rewards. Three star, wait, three guaranteed rewards for each victory battle. Earn event relics for the upcoming event. Yes, that's what I really want. Gold Tier Theaters, take on Pigsy in the most challenging battles in the Gold Tier Theaters. Earn the best rewards for the upcoming events, including Banner of Iron, Spearhead, Compass, Armored Boots, Steadfast Sling, Iron Mace, and more. Gold Tier Theaters are available once every 24 hours. Really? Silver Tier Theaters. Battle Volron in the Silver Tier Theaters for a chance to earn epic rewards for upcoming event, including Iron Mace, Iron Mel, Iron Guard, Iron Fist, Dragon Helm, and more. Silver Tier Theaters are available once every 12 hours. Bronze Tier Theaters Battle Bear Run in the Bronze Tier Theaters for a chance to earn powerful re rewards, including Iron Mace, Gilded. At Arc, Holy Guard, Van Brons, and more. Bronze tier theaters are available every six hours. Fight the arenas for a limited time for a chance to earn multiple rewards. After every arena battle, there'll be a timed cooldown pure arena before they can be attacked again. Fight more difficult battles for a greater chance of winning better rewards. Event tokens can be won in this theaters of war, which can be used in the upcoming event. Sweet. So I'll make sure I got all my stuff here. Make sure I got that. I also have some saved up myself. I got 31 of them saved up. Which I can get Vol Run. Pixie is actually the best one. Uh, yeah. And let's look at uh, let's look at the greens I got off of uh, by P10 
Uh, I got, yep. So, so far, no losses since I got her to P10. They even tried to capture it and still couldn't get it. All these greens, all these greens from the P10. Tight. 24 troops, by the way. They're 24 troops. And that's... That's like recently. That's like this morning. So the most recent attack that they lost was four hours ago. Yeah, you guessed it. Minivir P10. Yep. No losses. This actually build... It could be for any, it could be for militia, archers, whatever, you know, uh, spearmen. Try, I tried to get them attacked last night. Oh, you know, I did a stream and deleted it, but nobody was having it. I was like, what the fuck is going on here? So this is also a good... A good time to level up some Titans as well as the Theories of War, so I don't know what to do though exactly. <laughs> All the reskilled Titans are. I mean, this one is. This one was reskilled, but not recently. I don't know. Bobby Yaga is uh, one of the ones I was thinking about. So what's a Baba Yaga? And Lubu's still not done on the way. There's Cronus for the Panther collection. I just don't know which I just don't know. I always wanna I always wanna get all of them maxed out, but I just don't know. Which one to do next is the question. I have all the war gods done. I have all the reskilled ones except for that one that was like way long ago. And then, like, there's Wonka. He's not part of the Panther Collection. I guess I could do Baba Yaga for the upcoming and then try him out in the upcoming. Um, it's probably the only one. That one at Jinsu, maybe? Jinsu, that? Yeah. Wait, where did I, did I pass him? Yeah, I passed him. Of course, there's so many of these again. Yeah. Might as well try to drop some uh, some of these spells out here because I got to probably fill up from just grinding. Do 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 do. Okay, I need those for trees, lightning, and some reinforcements. I'm not gonna use the reinforcements. Now I did do this. I did this one just for whatever because of the Titan troop health, and you know that's pretty much <laughs> I did it for. I just threw that on there. Uh, I could do this one. It'll make the fort stronger. So, Pigsy, 25 troops. Uh, it's like extra, extra troops in there. Look at that. Oh, yeah. So, let's see if I get lucky. It's really about the prizes at the end of the bout. So I got nine, nine skeletons. Am I bringing, am I bringing these spells in? I'm not supposed to be. Let's put those all down right now. Now this is like a pixie without any um, relics on and stuff, so. Yeah, don't give them any ideas. Like, put relics on there. Put relics on the Titans you're fighting. 
<laughs> yeah. So this is the biggest one, supposedly. Let's see what we get. All three star relics. Uh, none of the event ones yet. And no relics of. Uh, I think they're called relics of war. I did get one wounded. So let's make sure I keep having enough. I'm going to trade a couple. Yeah, that's one thing you don't do is like you don't go in there and just uh, just use Titans. I like to get the XP off of these, always. So yeah. Plus, there's the I think they're called the Alters of Skirmish. Oh, I forgot to check that. Yeah, I think though the ones with the daily monuments in this event is called the Altars of Skirmish. <laughs> I don't know what's it's something. Yeah, she is a. a oh, I got oh, oh, oh snap! Oh my goodness! Oh my god! Oh, gee. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I gotta take a picture. Oh, my goodness. Oh, can you believe that this is probably the best uh, pull from the altars of everything and no one's watching? Uh, two Relics of War and uh, the Sun Scroll, which is for the upcoming event. T oh, my goodness. You can't, like, maybe if you had, like, two Sun Scrolls and Red Relic of War. Or if you had all th three Relics of War or three Sun Scrolls. That might be better, but uh, that never happens for me, ever. This is like the best one ever. Thank you, Debs. Oh my god, I can't believe it. That's so fucking awesome. Oh my goodness. So darn lucky. I love it. Okay, yes, I'm not. So I'm getting nine skeletons. I'm getting nine skeletons off this build with, uh, with Bobby Yaga so far. We could probably give more once. Once, though, he's more leveled up all the way. Iron Fist. Ooh, I don't have a four star one of that. That's probably one of the but it's not like super good or anything. So since so since I got that really good pull right there, I got now thirty three altars of war. And you can do the th what's cool about the thing is work. It's completely free. you can do it completely free. You just let your portal stones refresh. Of course, though, if you don't, if you have to wait for your portal stones to completely refresh, or you're gonna be like, oh, it's. See how close I'm getting to the next level? Because the Titan XP is huge on this. Plus, you get a little bit of player XP on here. So we have that tiny one there. We have two, three more, I think. Three more. I usually start with the smallest one because the timer is shorter. 
But I start with a bigger, bigger one this time. I don't know why. Nothing good there, just a bunch of fusing food. One minute, I'm not gonna wait that one minute. So, so far, only one event relic, but still, that's better than uh, last time. Last time I got. I got last minute event relics, that's it. Now, I keep forgetting this though. One day I want to do a video. Is it. Would it be cheaper to spin. So. It depends on what the Nurgle event though is. Oh, another, another Relics of War. Yes. Nice. Yeah, so I want to do like a video. So would it be cheaper, or like a stream or something, would it be cheaper to use the same amount of gems I would use in an event to attack the altars, the Theers of War? So let's say, so this, for example, right? This one here. It's 1,053, right? So... I could do like 58 attacks with 60, you know, 60k gems around around that area. Probably 58, probably maybe 59 um, attacks. And and how many event relics would drop? Would it be enough to finish the whole entire event? I mean, it's really down to luck, you know. But I just want to do a stream. To see if I'm that lucky or if it's even possible to be that lucky. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if I can explain that any better, but I've always wanted to do that. And I keep forgetting. Uh, so hopefully next month I can do that. I have to add $100 worth of gems. Uh, hey, Ken. Tanika is saying, and welcome to the stream chat. Oh, I'll fuse some food right there. I did get Bobby Egg up to 48, so that's good. I think though I did know all of them. I might. I feel like I might be missing one, but I, I did all of the, uh, th this side. So we're gonna go over this other side over here. Do these. Now these ones are just gonna be Titans over here. But I'd like to try to do them all at once so that way they all unshield on the same time. Now. Now with the, the Titan ones though, they're only every 24 hours and they all are unlocked. Not just one, all of them are unlocked. So yeah, so you can get, you know, a good amount of fusion food right here. Or let's say you just started out and you wanted to get some of those relics that the three stars provide. Some people do do that. Personally, for me, I haven't even I haven't done all of that, all the three stars that provide the Panty Collection relics, but that's going to be one of my last things. Right now, I'm just like in a phase. I I did a good majority of the four stars, and uh, I did all the good ones. I just don't know what to do now, which ones to do.
Bobby Yaga is part of the Panther Collection, but he's already... It's only level 40. You have to get them two. Look at that one trying to run for it. I got uh, a three star and two two stars. Nice. I don't know. I'm thinking about. I'm thinking about pulling the pixie, but at the same time, he is uh, you know very unique. Uh, he's not one of the boring old ones, but he's he is. He's pretty fun. And I fused him away, I think. I don't think I have him. I might. I did have him, but I fused him away. Yeah, three three stars. Nice. Do, do, do. Um, let me check that pixie there. <coughs> yeah, can can this sound? Sam says, what's your lion's name? Can I join? Maybe I can join. It's one of the ones. I don't know if we're full or to check. Yeah, I know I fused. It looks like I, sorry, I prestiged. It looks like I prestiged him away. Yeah. The only use he has is for uh, making VP on the land, but if it gets a bonus, it'll be capped easily. But that's the only purpose I could find for him. Um, yeah, one Genesis. And we have for full. Yep. I've been here at Masters. I forgot about the music. This is a different map. I've never, I haven't seen it. Were the trees this close? Oh, it's kind of different. Yeah, I see Baba Yaga is good for assault. I don't think it's good for conquest at all, but for assault. Not the best though, but he is one of those ones that can make a good decent amount of points. So I wanna try I wanna test him against the other ones like the Totec and uh, and the segment and now the hell. I tried my hell. I don't know if it's the troop level or the build or what, but against the Minivera. 
my hill. She didn't do it. And it was only a prestige four. Many beer. Which is a, it's a good thing. Yeah, maybe Menavir is going to be Hatchimon. Maybe Menavir is... Hey, 64 Gizzle, welcome to stream chat. Maybe Menavir, guys, is going to be a Hatchimon where it's going to be special relics, special tactics to beat her at Prestige 10. Or even, you know... And she'll last for a very long time. But uh, instead of people looking at positive side and looking at the bad side. This says show your strength. Yes, yeah, show your strength. You missed that part already. Fortunately though, uh, my Baba Yaga is so strong that she just ran over Pigsy like it was nothing. <laughs> Pigsy was the only challenge really. I mean, that took like, you know, a minute and a half. No, I think it has to do with troop level. I think my troop level's pretty decent. I remember when I was, you know, like level 14 troops, I had the hardest time at Theaters of War. Oh, yeah. I guess though I'm gonna have to start going into the um, the boring part of my game where I'm just gonna have to level up each Titan because I did all the good ones, so we're just gonna have to go do all the bad, you know, all the crappy ones, get them leveled up, see if they can do anything. So the so you from the one of the monuments you can get a four star titan. I got none today. Uh, you can't get event relics. I got one only, which is uh, a lot better than last time. Last time it took me, I think it was a uh, took me to the last day, like the last hours to get them, and then it gave me like two or three. Oh, this one I got a three star. Nice. That's that's rare to get a three star on the smaller ones. <clears throat> Remember back in the day when they were all like ones and twos? Uh, I played back in the day. They're all ones and twos and over here in the monuments. So I got I got the, all that. I got that one. That one. I think they're all done now. I'm thinking about maybe gym, gymming up one more time. Where is it? Which one? This one? Yeah, it's this one. Yeah, so look, I have 34 now. The the thing, though, is I usually use these for, um... Like, Pixie is... I mean, it's been a long time since... They've actually put a Titan that's decent. You know? Pixie is not one of those ones that the skills are readable, you know? Where there's just like one little tiny thing. So like, take a look at the difference. So Volron... So let's, so let's say Volron is equal to... This one, Okay. So Volrod is like this one. I don't have Volrod, so I can't show you. But you can read the skills, you know. Pixie is more like... Let's 
see, where's one? Like a reskilled Cronus was back in that day. Let's see, what about Cronus? Is Cronus more readable now? Nope, it's readable. But he was reskilled. So they they should reskill him again. But Pigsy is a little bit more than that. So I mean I can't I can't see which one I could uh hmm. So like maybe the segment skills are equal to Pigsy? Yeah, so see how it's like harder to read the the these skills here? Yeah, that's how much stuff is in Pigsy, but um, I'm not saying that she is like the ultimate defender. You know, yeah, I'm saying that Pigsy, sorry, he, not she. <laughs> yeah, Pigsy is definitely not something that is like, you know, you can't go take an old Titan and attack Pigsy. No, no, you gotta have one of the war gods, one of the dragon slayers, or one of the new metas. Yeah. But for me, though, because I'm up in Masters and stuff, though, Pigsy is... Um, so that's why I'm like, I don't know if I want to get get Pigsy. Uh, I'm going to probably just save, and we'll do one more. We'll go ahead and uh, gym this and do one more. See if I get lucky again. So I'm going to probably just save it and save the Relics of War for uh... Ooh. For what do you call it? For for uh, some few prestige food. And whatever I keep saying fuse it for, I don't fuse these four stars. But yeah, it's only 30 Relics of War, which I do have. I have over 30 now to get just one four star Titan, which could be used for prestige. I know it's it's like you just to get them wherever you can, you know, just get them wherever you can, just because <laughs> you're gonna have to add them up, get them from this event, get them from this that event, get them from that event, and eventually you'll be able to max prestige, or. Maybe, though, let's say you're unlucky with Relics of War, and it takes you a whole entire meta just to get enough to get one four-star Titan. So hopefully the next Theaters of War is Poison, because that's what I really need. Oh! Oh! Oh my goodness. OMG. Oh, God! Oh, that is so awesome. Look at that. Oh my goodness, guys, look at this. Another Sun Scroll. Which, guys, guess what? The Sun Scrolls, right? The tokens is 2k gems, and I only spent 1,000 and something gems. So this is definitely worth it. And it, and I'm not going to keep doing this, though. Um, uh, and a Relic of War. And, and a 4-star Giant Axe. What? Which, I already have two of the giant axes. Um, so, I have two of the giant axes. Or three now. One's level five or something. It has critical in there. Uh, so, like a physical type needs critical. That's what I would use it for. So, but that's also going to be really... Four stars. Extra four stars like that are really also really good for fusing... Uh, another another relic up. Okay, let's see if I can find it. I actually do. I need to get this necklace up too. For that was that was for a pixie build. <laughs> for attack, I guess. Let's see if I can find the giant axe. Giant axe. Giant axe. Giant axe. Where are you? I also have this too for the upcoming Urgle event because it's going to be solar, right? So that means the all these are going to be uh, usable for that. I guess the giant axe is further than I thought. 
down here in the G's, past the D's, past the B's and the D's, the D's, the D's, knees and the B's, D's, those are. There it is. So I have three now. I got one at ten, one at five, and because back in the day, I was doing uh, physical uh, solo titans, and uh, yeah, I needed that. But Titan Critical. Right now, though, uh, that's the new thing is Titan Critical to unlock troops and stuff. So yeah, but this was really good on a solo physical titan. But right now, there isn't. Uh, what's what would be a good physical solo tank left? Well, is, is there any solo tanks left that are physical? That are any good? I don't think so. Babel doesn't need the critical, do, no, so in heat physical, uh, you have Gaia, Gaia needs the critical, but she is not physical, she's earth. Hell needs the critical, but she's lightning. That's poison. No. Mahaha needs the critical, but he is uh, ice, unfortunately, so that's not going to work. So, really, that real I don't need it for anybody right now. Uh, who else? Anybody else? Nope, nope, no. No, 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 no. Okay, well. I want to keep one. I'm just going to keep one. I already have... So... So let's uh, take a look again. Yep. So this is Menavir on defense, guys. Same land as uh, for since yesterday. All and now that she's a P10, and it's 24 militia, no losses up in here in Masters. So if you look at the land, right? Look at the land. The land is the same name. The forest. Of Medanera or Mananera, however you say it, right? No losses. You see raids on other lands, okay? But not that one. It's the same name, and you can actually really, there's a little thing here, you can actually take you right to the land. Boom, right there. Push, push on defend. Boom, now you see Medanera. Okay? So it's I'm doing all militia build. It's not it's not a build just for militia. It's a this build is for anything. Okay, so let's take a look see. Titan physical damage, base troop health, that's any troop any troop. Titan and troop range and melee uh, resist. So this is so the last two skills are good for any troop, but the first one is only for Titan physical. It doesn't apply to any other Titan. But the there is two skills at a, at a uh, Titan and troop armor piercing, that's any troop, any Titan. Titan and army critical, that's any Titan, any, ar any army, any troop. All troop resist against all elements, that's any troop type right there. That's why I did that. And also the juice, baby, the juice is Titan and troop health, that's any Titan and troop. Titan and troop all element resist, that's Titan, any Titan, any troop. On enemy def Offensive spell shield titan max eight. That's any titan and does. And banner of war titan and troop all element damage. That's any titan and any troop it does for. Twenty percent all troop resist against melee and damage. That's any troop type right there. All troop resist against range damage. That's any troop type right there. Twenty percent. I still have the Dragonfly Pursuit, 60% Titan troop damage three times on defense. That's any Titan and any troop 
since she's on defense, that's 120, 100, uh, that's 180% Titan and troop damage on defense. Whoo! 180%. And they have also 80% Titan and troop armor piercing. That's any Titan and any troop. On allied troop death, 25% chance to call the same troop max 5. That's any troop. You also have this. Draco's Lampets. The first skill is Titan Fizzle Damage, which is only towards physical, and she is physical. 40% uh, Titan and Troop Health. That's any Titan and any Troop Health. 18% Titan and Troop Range Resist, uh, Range and Melee Resist. That's any Titan and any Troop Range uh, and Melee Resist. So there, I mean, we only have two skills out of all that, but it's for Titan Physical. Every other skill in this build is for any troop type. Now let's take a look see at the stats of the militia that I put on on the land. 134 percent, sorry, 134,000 damage, 516 health is 676,023. Armor piercing, 320% critical chance, 79%. On defense armor is 405. Malayne is 100, range is 98. And the resistor, 80%. Not 100, 80%. And nobody has been able to beat her over 24 hour period. Spells are only 21 shields, and she, whatever she's doing right now, she's boosting it. I don't have the staff of shields. I don't have any relics that are boosting shields, so she's boosting the shields right now. And it looks like it's just the damage of the shields. Uh, five, four, three, one, two, eight. Uh, maybe it's 543,128. I don't know what those numbers exactly mean. And only 21 though. So, doing this, and then also the Titan. Let's take a look at the Titan. The power of power is 6,080,243. Her damage is the highest I've ever seen any Titan. 403,358. Health is over half a mil. 567,758 speed is only 3 armor piercing 350,000 it's not bad but it's not the highest critical chance not the low but not super high either 84% armor piercing on defense is really low So uh, defense armor on defense 10% that's not that much Belain and range 38 each and then the rest of the resist is 90%. So the resist not bad on that. Malay range could go higher. But the troop stats are what's probably holding it up, not her. At the same time, though, she'll probably kill a few troops because of her damage is huge. P10, though, maybe, yeah. So when you call legendary, though, on, on P10, another... 50% chance to call another one. <laughs> oh, yeah. And I noticed that when I was attacking, though, there was also popping troops. So there's the legendaries that drop. But also at the same time, there seemed to be uh, more troops dropping when I was attacking. So, yeah. So I just want to put that out there. Uh, it's all resist build uh, for all troop type. So it doesn't matter what troop you put on there. If Let's say you have 24 troops down the board and you have 25. You use this build, guys. You know This will work on a P10. It will work okay on a P9 as well. So I did get lucky twice today, so that's good. Right, I'll see you guys on the battlefield. Woo, woo, woo.